Ladies and gentlemen, the UDA Party Electoral Nomination Disputes and Resolution Committee has today nullified the outcome of the MP nomination results in Nandi County. During the nomination process, which was carried out on 19th of April, the person who emerged the winner during party nomination was none other than Alfred Keter, who had around 10,000 votes, followed by Bernard Kitur with around 7,000 votes and followed by a certain guy called Chekon with around 2,000 votes. Just after Alfred Keter was declared the winner, Bernard Kitur tabled the evidence and raised issues to the uh, UDA party nomination, electoral nomination and uh, dispute resolution committee who today find out that the evidence tabled was correct and they decided to nullify the outcome of the results. Some of the issues raised by Bernard Kitu during that party nomination malpractices is the issue of um, delayed ballot uh, materials in some places and therefore majority of the voters did not turn up and vote. The second thing was about the issue of insufficient ballot papers. The insufficient ballot papers led to some of the voters who did not participate in the voting and they decided to go away. And the committee of the UDA party has decided to nullify the outcome of those results respectively. And they are going to go back to election once more. I don't know if this is a political uh, a political issue because we all know that Alfred Keter is not uh, an ally of Deputy President William Samuel Ruto. The only time Alfred Keter decided to uh, work together with Deputy President William Samuel Ruto is when he wanted the party ticket. But all along, he has been seen, we have witnessed him talking badly about Deputy President William Samuel Ruto. But remember that William Ruto, he himself announced that he is the one in charge of the UDA party nomination all over the country. So, if this is something to do with politics, then only time will tell, ladies and gentlemen. But what can you say about this, this, uh, this, this, this issue? Is it free and fair? Or is something, or there is a game, political game, that people are trying to play around there? Only time will tell. Please, ladies and gentlemen, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give this video a thumbs up. And if you do love my videos, let me hear your thoughts on the comment section below. Thank you and see you in the next video. Thank you guys for your support.